Hey everybody and welcome back to another book review. So I um, have a love for Greek mythology that I probably shouldn't have. <laughs> um, but I really do. Um, especially a lot of the uh, myths and the stories and things that come out of um, the plays um, that were created during that period. Antigone is one of my favorite plays. Um, and so I was very excited to read um, another uh, Hannah Lynn uh, audio book slash read. Um, and that is, uh, or the book is A Spartan's Sorrow. Um, and the whole time I was reading, I was like, I need somebody to make this a play because I want to be quite a master. <laughs> like um, back when I was in, um, <clears throat> in college, one of the plays that we did was the Penelope, which tells the story of the Odyssey from Penelope's perspective. Penelope is Odysseus's wife, um, and just kind of everything that's going on back at home. And so this story follows really the same format of it is telling um, the story of Agamemnon and everything that's going on back at home with um, his wife Clytemestra while they are all off fighting, all the men are off fighting in the Trojan War. Um, so I was very, very excited to read this story because I love stories like this. Um, and this is the second in her like series of like stories about like kind of changing up like the whole Greek mythology thing um, and giving like a different perspective really. Um, and so I was, um, I just, I fell in love with it right away because it reminded me of the Penelope um, and just the characters and the way that she created a slightly different angle of the story um, was phenomenal. Just really, really loved it. Um, so yeah, it, it's it's oh, it's a great book. Um, I am giving it a 4.5 out of 5. Um, partially not a 5 because I wasn't as big of a fan of the ending. I felt like... Um, I feel like there were multiple points where the story could have ended and I understood why she took it all the way to the end of uh, the trial of Orestes, but I just kind of felt like the trial was like it happened and then it was like, eh, okay, cool, great, sweet. Like it just, it just kind of dropped for me um, right at the end. But that said, the rest of the story, <clears throat> loved it. Uh, so yeah, yeah, um, it made me just, it reminded me of why I love uh, Greek tragedy and Greek plays. I am a Greek person, not a Shakespeare person. And those people that are in the theater community, they understand. <laughs> like, you are either a Shakespeare person or you're not. And I am not a Shakespeare person. I am a Greek person. Um, I love the Greek stuff. Um, so, yeah, I just uh, loved it. Loved it, loved it, loved it. Such a good book. I'm very um, excited to continue to read um, the books and the series. Um and um there's some other authors that are doing some other similar things that i've had on my list um so i'm working through all of those i'm very excited to work through those um just uh, i i just really like when we change when we change the narrative i just love books and stories that do that and and yeah i just i can't say enough good things about this um so yeah um spartan sorrow by Hannah Lynn. Um, just really, really good. Kudos to, I don't remember who, a couple people actually suggested this one. Um, and there's um, a lot of the Greek stuff that's been on my list has been suggested by the same like four people. Um, so thank you guys for suggesting um, this book. It was uh, just a really great book. Um, so yeah, that is the end of this book review. I mean, I could just go on and on and on about how great it is. Um, but I won't. Um, so this is the end of that, this book review. Be on the lookout for the next one. Um, and as always, please continue to share books that you um, think I would like or, or things like that. I literally just add things to the list. Um, and I'm, again, like I said at the beginning of 2024, I'm working from the bottom of the list to the top. So every time I add, it goes at the top and then I work through, from bottom up because I'm trying to get through all the ones that you guys have uh, suggested over the last couple years. Um, and I want to make sure that I honor your suggestions by actually reading them. Um, so getting through a lot of these has been um, joyous and cool because I get to see, you know, what friends are 
are loving and liking and all that stuff so yay um i will see you in the next book review bye